everybody, my name is Dude, and welcome back to Hot Awful Boyfriend. Let's get to right where we left off and see how long this lasts, because I think we only have a few... Eh, I don't know, maybe a few more... Like, one more episode to go, considering I was here on Ryota's. Assuming it's the same length, maybe not. Still light out, so maybe I'll go somewhere before I head home. Whee! Mars Legman Beans. I'm gonna go buy some beans! It's a holiday where you give beans to the boy you like, but apparently it used to involve throwing them at pigeons. Disgraceful. Why would I throw them at Nagaki? We can like, get this year's trend toward Bean Resley for racers. They're a little pricey. It's hard to say without knowing the burning question. The cheap ramen tastes better than the expensive stuff. I think I'll buy. What will I buy? Um, hmm. I don't, I don't know. I, I, I don't know. I'm gonna say... Palm corn, but I don't know. Hmm. Tree. What does he seem like? What does he seem like? I don't know a better. I don't. I don't know about that. That sounds bad. Um. Swollen hemp. Racing blend. Calm corn. He looks like a calm. He looks like he'd enjoy calming this. I'll take the common corn, and we'll go there, and we'll be fine, Standy. Standy. Give the beans to that special sunbirdy. Almost empty as always, and unsurprisingly, the heat doesn't work in here. So the winter cold will stick around well through February. The pervading chill has earned the library the dubious honor of being one of the school's least popular places in winter. A few students here are huddled around the heater, so Nagaki should be over there. There you are, Nagaki. Sitting in a frigid corner, far from the meager, meager effects of the heater, as expected. Please be quiet in the library. Can you somehow forgive my dreadful sin? It's cold in here. Are you okay, Nagi? I'm fine. Don't mind me, Miss Ragel. Just feel free to go sit by the heater if you're cold. Nope, I'm fine. The house doesn't have a heater after all. It's also a cave, which I'd love to invite you to, but I think you're kind of a ghost attached to this library already. And if that is actually the case, no, this is not spoiled for me. <laughs> Dagamantines, you know. Here you go. For me. Yep. You're supposed to give beans to the most important bird in your life today. Do you want them? Yes, thank you. He worthlessly accepts the beans and stares at the packages if he doesn't know what to do with it. Maybe he's never gotten Legamantine beans before. I hope he likes them. I hope he can actually eat them too, considering he may in fact be a ghost. Lots of requested books are going to come in today. I'll have to work through lunch. Shit. Uh, sorting all these books takes forever. <laughs> I think I just have the encyclopedias to do before I'm done. Eh? There's a note on the help desk counter. Um, Miss McFragel, be here after the other students have left. Fujishiro Nagiki. Reads like a challenge to a samurai duel. How fitting. Is this the first time he's approached me? wonder what that's all about. Maybe he's gonna finish the story. Are you here, Nagaki? Nagaki? Uh, here. Hello, Miss Fraggle. Nick Fraggle. You startled me! How long have you been standing there? From the very beginning. So what'd you need? I wanna talk with you, Miss McFraggle. Talk with me? I'm gonna continue our conversation. We're talking about bullying, I think? Okay. Lay on me, soul brother! Not sure where to start. That's a lot since we last spoke together. Miss McFraggle. Mm-hmm. Let's go outside. What? What? But he hates going outside. Come on. Stands up and walks over to the door. I follow, agitated. You first. Okay. Why does he want to go outside all of a sudden? I should be happy, but... Eh? What's wrong? You said you wanted to come out here. He stands in the door I pushed against open air. Pushing against open air. What are you doing? Mime? Watch. Walks back a little ways into the library and then runs forward, crashing into the air. Nagaki, what? He, um... He literally can't leave the library, can he? Bounces off the invisible wall and falls back into the library. That's too good to be a mime act. As I thought. I can't leave. What? I can't leave this room. I wake up in this library. After a while, I lose consciousness and wake up here again. So it repeats. 
He said I'd come to understand the truth by talking to you, Miss Fra McFraggle. You probably noticed, too, why no one else talks to me. It's because... They can't see you. I'm the only one who can see you, aren't I? Probably. But I forget why I was here. How I came to be stuck in this place. I've been alone here for years with no one to talk to. For years. My sense of time is broken. I am looking through you, buddy. I cannot feel or remember its passage. I've seen at least five school festivals go by. Then you came and talked to me. I had had no partner but myself for so long, and suddenly, you wouldn't leave me alone. As I talked to you, I finally remembered why I can't leave. I killed myself in this- Oh, dude, no! Dude. So here I stay. My clock broke here, its hands turning meaninglessly each day, the same as the last. Alone, forever. No one's bullying me or ignoring me. I'm not here to begin with. You're being more see-through, dude. I have no regrets. It was my choice to end my life here, after all. I think I will miss you, Miss McGregor. If I wasn't like this, I would... I would have liked to talk to you more for longer. I could keep- Dude! Got my arms around him. I can feel him softly, but he's cold. First sitting here alone was painful. I grew numb over time. I ceased to feel pain. That feeling I thought I thought I had lost came back. Because of you. I'll talk to you enough to make up for everyone else, Nagaki. Maybe one day I'll be able to leave. No. Why not? As I talked to you, I changed. I didn't notice until just recently. When you told me about this school, I was probably trying to take back the time I was never able to spend here. I never asked you to, but you relentlessly told me everything that was going on here. I already feel like I've spent a full year at this school. And... Now it's over. I think the clock's hands are gonna stop soon. Don't you dare leave haunt my ass! I don't care! His head is right next to mine, but his voice sounds muffled and distant. When we look down, his feet are already disappearing. I can key now! We've never talked like this before. I want this I don't want this to be the last time. Don't cry, Miss McFraggle. I'm already long gone. There's no one here to mourn. Yeah, there is! You! There's just one thing I need to tell you before I go. The thing that I noticed. The secret that stopped my clock. Don't you dare speak it! As I filled up, I grew closer to disappearing. You're the one who made me disappear, Miss Mc... Shit! I'm the... Fuck! God damn it! Ah! Uh, if he wasn't disappearing, this wouldn't be so bad! Ugh! Mmm! God damn it! You've given me more than enough. I'm satisfied. The secret. Thank you. I love you. Fuck, dude. Fucking hell. <sighs> How am I supposed to take that? Shit.
Dreams end, huh? <sighs> yeah. Happy ending, my asshole. Ugh. Damn it. Damn it. Damn fuck. Ah. Uh. Oh, I'm not happy with that. I guess I gave him peace or something, but fuck. Ah. Uh. God damn it. <sighs> Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this this ending of Hotful Boyfriend. I'm gonna be left empty for a little bit. Fuck. I didn't cry, unfortunately. It was very feelsy. Fuck, I am... Ugh. Doing anything anymore today just feels wrong. But I should probably get doing it, so thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Leave a like if you did. Subscribe for more. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Thank you to T. Cower and somebody for supporting me on Patreon this month, and I'll see you guys in the next video. This game is probably going to get a lot more feelsy the more endings I do. But I should probably keep doing it. I'm probably going to be told to keep doing it. Right, Abby? Right, Abby? Right. Uh, uh, I, I will. Anyway, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye! So Chica's our healer. I don't know what party favors does. But... What did that do? Is it like the wimpy heal? Yep. Oh. Yep. Cut. Ow. I missed. Didn't I?